something something very sensitive sensitive to the society and um, we wouldn't like to to follow the negative you know um, thinking from the society so if we can create something like this if we can create this kind of a project how can we go about it that's a question to ask My name is Balu Mulukman Olapule. I'm a graduate of Yaba College of Technology. I'm an artist, a visual artist. I specialize in sculpture. Art is a visual way of expressing oneself. And we have great artists like um, Richard McDonald, Blair Boswell, Harry Moore. And looking at here in Nigeria, we have people like Kolade Oshinowo, Adiola Balugun, and many more. Looking at these great artists, I've been able to link my work with some of my works with theirs. Someone like Richard McDonald is a very good sculptor when it comes to modeling, he modeled life. And looking at some of my works, I did some live modeling. Judge mostly on um, life modeling. And looking at um, Adiola Balogun, linking my work to the great Adiola Balogun, I will say also about his meta works. I've learned a lot of, from him and his metal works, his, he has done a lot of metal works and which um, we can see from his work to mine, you can see a link in our works. I'm a core member currently serving in Oshogbo Ocean State. I don't enter, give me the microphone, or oh God pass it to me. Daily and daily I'm ringing the rhythm now, I just they walk it. I they hustle and hustle and hustle, they could not clear my road, they carry your load. This life is a tussle and bustle. Washington State is a state that is filled with a lot of good people. My major means of transportation here in Nashon are bikes and Korokwe. And with regards to that Korokwe, it is very, very cheap. As an artist, wherever you find yourself, you must be able to have a landmark. In the sense that you making sure you allow the environment to reflect on you, on what you do, on your work. Whichever way you find it, your work, your environment must reflect on you. This is Oshogbo in Ocean State and I've tried to observe the environment closely. You look at Ocean State, you look at the women, the most common thing you see around you is the hijab. About hijab, it's, it's very, 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 very rampant. People wear hijab here and there. Most schools, you see students. I don't think it's compulsory, but, but most public schools, they wear hijab. They wear hijab a lot. So, I've been, I've been pondering on that. I want to, I want to explore with it. I want to do something about it by um, doing some artwork. You know, as an artist now, you have to at least allow your environment to reflect on your work. So, I want to, I want to try and explore on that as an artist. With hijab, that's 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 a religious something. This is not me preaching something religious. This is me flowing with my environment. And you have to flow with your environment as a visual artist. Yes. That's, that's uh, how do you intend going about it now? As in, what's the goal? Trust me, talking to these guys helped me arrive at conclusions quick, quick. I know him to be someone drawing out inspirations from things he comes across like that. And uh, for him to bring out heart out of religion, I am very, very skeptical about what he is about to do. I intend doing um, some couple of some couple of drawings and maybe one or two meta works, and I'll be making use of models. I spoke to Rashida already. I was at school when Lukman texted me about the hijab idea, and I was really confused. Then he called me to the phone, and we talked, and I was like, "Wow, this looks and sounds major." I picture Rashida in most of this art already. She liked the idea, and that was a good for me. So this is a 
or project that got his inspiration here in Ocean State. How do you intend to bring Rashida and Skulin outside Ocean to come and play a major role? That got me worried. Because how do you want me to do this? I had to ask you. We did some of these things over the phone. There were days I had to call and give directions on how to take the pictures I needed her to send. Tackled with man, like I did tackle with man. I asked him questions because I needed to be sure he he was sure about what he was doing about the job. Like I needed to know he knew what he was doing about the job and then he delivered. Hey Rashida, how are you? I got some of the pictures. But there's something missing. I'm not I'm not feeling the emotions yet. I can't see the pain in the picture. You saw the things I didn't see. You'd call, explain to me, and I was snap the picture and send him just the way he explained it to me. And in less than five seconds my phone rings and it'll be like something is missing. And I'll be like, What? One of the things I learned from Lokman is as a visual artist, you don't settle for less. You get the exact thing you want. If something is missing, you look for it and find it. You sent earlier today. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, great. Thank you. Yeah. Um, I, she was able to give me what I wanted. Um, a, a job, a job lady, with this facial expression of somebody that is not worried, somebody that is just focused and believe whatever is coming, is ready for it no matter what. Working with picture is not a bad, bad idea because um, even though my model is not around, that's why we have picture there, so I have to make use of picture to do whatever, whatever I want to do. But um, using picture, I can take time to go for break and come back to the work and finish it well. Myself, there's this free flow of lines and all, oh, and it's, it's really a fantastic work, even to me. Well, looking at the 
duration of time, I don't think I use up to 35 minutes. Let's say just 30 minutes. I finished that in 30 minutes because that's what I used to look at. 30 minutes. I was pleased with our facial um, pictures. When you look at our society, you see people go through a lot. A lot is going on. Deep down in their hearts, everything going on around us, but they still wear this smile. They want to be strong. When you look at them, you see these people are strong. But so I want this, I want this facial expression showing this smile, someone smiling, and when you look into the eyes, you when you connect to it, you will know a lot is going on deep down here. A lot is going on. Ese amor llega así de esta manera, no tiene la culpa. Caballo le lanza vana, porque muy despreciado, por eso no te perdono llorar. Ese amor llega así de esta manera, no tiene la culpa. Amor de compra y venta, amor de en el pasado. Ven, 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 ven. Pamboleo, pamboleo, porque mi vida yo la aprendí a vivir así. Pamboleo, pamboleo, porque mi vida yo la aprendí a vivir así. No te da perdón de Dios. Tú eres mi vida, la fortuna de mi destino. El destino te ha desaparado. Lo mismo ya callé, lo mismo soy yo. No te encuentro la mano. Eres posible, no te encuentro de verdad. Por eso un día no cuento si de nada Lo mismo ya callé, lo pienso en ti Bambolea, bambolea Porque en mi vida yo la aprendí a vivir así Bambolea, bambolea Porque en mi vida yo la aprendí a vivir así Especially when you're modeling for an artist, you know, that's different from you, a, a, a photo shoot model or a runaway model. She really, really tried. She really, she, I marveled at the at her cooperation during the work. Uh, life drawing is visual presentation of what you see, especially uh, uh, the humans. It was a bit challenging taking the pictures Likma wanted me to take. Because aside the pictures, you wanted to emotions. I had to come down to Ocean State and I met with Lukman and we had the first live drawing. There are people when they are going through a lot like this drawing, they still give you this smiley face and when you look into their eyes, when you study them where you see a lot is going on with them but they still give you this, this face even though it's all focus and all. But some people when they are going through a lot, they give you this 
focus phase, as in the where this all focus phase. I want this drum.
so I had to I had to draw I had to run um, a draw um, a drawing of the um, a sketch a sketch of the metal work on the floor, so that will guide me on how to go about the bending of my iron. Then try to make the flow, try to weld out the flow of um, the fold. When you look at it, you see the way the flow the the fold goes using the metal plate to cover it. After doing that, I have to do um to put up um cut out my plate first using a, a paper to bring out the template and cut out the printing plate and i'm perforate it putting holes around it so that i can i can see i can it can allow me to penetrate the copper wire into it all around to stitch it up Gave his all to this work. Like um, he managed time, he managed resources. Considering where he, where he, like the whole thing happened, there wasn't access to all the materials he would have needed. But he did improvise and he did a very, very good job. Out of recent, metal work has taken a new dimension, where they now have to almost use it to represent an art that is maybe in, in reality. You see how they treat metal, you think it is clay work. I was able to see him do some of those metal works and then um, God, the way Lukman handles these things, he makes metal look like paper. Never 
never believe The verge of life That my one in there waiting for me and you They make a brother say I want to run away Run away Run away Run away Where they just see go Run away It takes, um, it takes focus to do a, um, an outside live drawing, an outdoor live drawing, to say, because people people come around to see what's going on. People that this thing is new to. When you drop someone before you and everything is just flowing, people come around, say all sort of things, and you know you have to focus on what you are doing. Some people will say some funny things that you want to look, but. It's not ideal because when you when you allow that to get to you, you might lose you might lose focus of what you are doing. So and looking at Oshoboye, I don't think it's something very common around here. Artists doing an outdoor drawing and all, but it's very it's it's, it's to me it, I I allowed that I didn't allow that to really get to me because I had to just do what I had to do and just take my head off whatever that is going on around me. Wow. Look, when, when it comes to his work, he has a very high level of professionalism. Hey, Roba, you see, you have no run. So, you just want to make sure, okay? You can get to the fellow, you just have to say, oh, 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 There's something we call uh, mixed media. Okay, mixed media is all about you combine this material with the other material. Also, bending the metal works when, in the absence of the necessary tools to use to bend rods, you know, I have to improvise using my strength to do that, using power to bend and even to cut. There are easy way of getting things done, but. In the absence of all these tools to use in getting all these things done, I have to just improvise. I've seen how he has been able to communicate with the meta he uses to express 
is at. Getting this printing plate, this aluminum plate, getting it around here is very, 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 very. It's it's, it's a very scarce material because you hardly see it around here. So I have to go travel miles before I can get it and even look from one place to the other. And once in a while, light here has not been cool. Situation whereby the light is faulty. And even getting the metals too. It's it's very, very far from where I do my work. Oh, na 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 na. Yeah. In the early 90s, that was the beginning. Mama had me, she was definitely smiling. Finally, a boy, she was very, very happy. She prayed for this with the love of her life. Yeah. She called me grace, she called me blessing. She looked into my eyes, called me love of her life. I wish I could go back and feel what she felt. But she goes on her knees and tell God what she felt. Yeah. Joy, nothing but joy. Every other day, she feels nothing but joy. Showers of blessing, God bless that plenty. Thank God for blessing, love of my life. Yeah. Joy. Nothing but joy Every other day she feels nothing but joy We didn't have much but she loved me still When well, she thank God for blessing Love of my when life When I was a little boy mama tell me I would chase your dreams And keep believing And the sky will be your beginning When I was a little boy mama told me My boy chase your dreams And keep believing and your peak will be your beginning When I was a little boy, mama told me Love will set you free My boy, please believe it Cause this love is for real When I was a little boy, mama told me My boy, chase your dreams And keep believing And the love will set you free yeah, yeah. One time for my people where sabi Where they feel with the music Where they buy my CD I say two times for the people where sabi Where they buy all the tickets Where they come for my shows I say three times for the people where sabi Where they play my music Where they dance as on to I say four times for my people where sabi Where they support the music Where they pray for me I say joy, nothing but joy Every other day you see nothing but joy I pray God bless you, bless your family Wish you what you wish me, God bless my people Joy, nothing but joy Every other day you see nothing but joy I pray God bless you, bless all your family Wish you what you wish me, God bless my when people I was a little boy, mama using, the same, using the same material, using metal rod um, Aluminium plates and copper wire To portray um, a, a job person looking sideways Having this fold, there's this fold of you see in the hijab trying to make use of a metal rod and pretty plate to bring out the food to execute that is part of what i try to portray in this um, in this particular metal work
Being a part of this project really means a lot to me. Um, I don't know how to express this, but it's one of the best things that's ever happened to me. This works, all of this works, is what any great artist would have done. This project is classic, fantastic project, very incredible project. This drawing, this, this metal work, they, they are very iconic. Visually, the work is so rich, and uh, I think the sky is, is living. Hijab, hijab, the whole hijab concept is... Um, it has been cool. The whole idea was just cut out from the scratch, trying to come up with, um, trying to jump, come to conclusion about how I'm going to go about it, the rendering, the materials to use, the medium, and every every having, and talking to talking to people, talking to some of my friends, sharing this idea with people helped me a lot to come to conclusion on time, which. It's drawings, it's detailed drawing books and uh, the whole concept, the whole, the whole all about my environment which I got from here in Oshun State and I had to just come up with the whole thing as up and it's, it's, it's really it's really it's really a fantastic work and I'm very pleased and it's, it was fun for me working on this project.